welcome to Angie's Creative Studio. I'm Angie, and today we are going to do a sunflower. Yes, my hair was fixed at one time today, but it's been one of those days. I am using an F lid, and this is the fine touch, and I'm going to draw it, and all. And we're going to try to. And I'm gonna make pretty big leaves or petals, should I say? How's everybody doing? Did y'all all have a fun Fourth of July? Mine was okay. Okay, now I'm going back in and just adding more petals in between. Now, I am going to call this my mixed media day on Mondays. And uh, with that being said, I'm going to kind of erase this. Because I don't want it that dark. I am, today I'm going in with uh, watercolors and then I'm going over with uh, Crayola pencils to get the look I want. <laughs> well, I think that's what I'm doing anyways. I am using a pretty excellent paint set today. And let's see if this is clean. Oh, I'm shocked. It's clean. It's clean. Y'all, you don't know how bad it is. I mean, I have a clean. But I'm using this as my palette today. And let me get some of this stuff out of my way. Okay, I am going in. Let me find my... I know what I think it should be called, but I'm not for sure. I am going in with Sipa. To do my round part of my... Just... This. And the further I come in, the lighter I'm gonna get. And I should have changed the pink one. Now I'm just gonna pull what I've got out. Just like so. And I'm I'm going to mess it. Whoops, so it's a fan. Right, brush. I'm just going to use this fine mist. And I'm going to mess my paint because it's been a while since I've used these paints. And I am using a mixed media pad today. Um, from it, it's the master touch. I mean, it's been through back and back, but I, I don't know. I still like these after all the ones I've got. I still like these, and maybe because I'm I've used them so much. Let's see. My phone goes off a dozen times a day, so shouldn't be no big deal. Mm -hmm. 
And I'm just going in with the sleeper. I am using. I have no clue what. It is a wool and lang nickel brush today. Uh, I don't know what size it is. I have no clue. It's not a big one, but it's not no itty bitty one. I'd say probably a four or a six at the most. Probably more like a four than a six. I mean, that's my opinion. I'm not for sure one. It came in one of those uh, little art kits, right? Uh, Wall and Lang Nichols Christmas art kits is what it probably came in. If I was a guessing. Okay. Now I am going in with yellow orange well, I'm gonna put yellow orange here on my palette let me rephrase that and my water is nasty guys I should have changed it I am gonna have to tape my fan down to my table I am using the drafting table if you want to know, I am using OBS software to run my cameras. Okay, now I'm going to add cadmium yellow to this. in the cadmium yellow but not so dark that it's not going yeah y'all can tell I'm not used to being a camera I am not the one to tell your kids to watch and and do as she says because I will not because I'm not one I don't pay attention I mean I just do it But my husband thinks I need to be on camera more. <clears throat> this, I am filming this on 4th of July, guys. This may not be one of my smartest ideas. I am doing the, the back leaves in this yellow orangey color. This is how I paint a lot of the time. Does anybody else have a busy week this week? Mine's actually not as busy as it has been. So, it, that helps. 
this. I shouldn't make these so big, I don't think. It may have to go in and draw some more. Now I am going in with the cadmium yellow and I'm just going to put some out here on my palette before they light on this. I'm not trying to get my donks and my lights and all in yet. I'm going to use uh, colored pencils for that. I need a drink. Excuse me. Okay, now I'm going in and just kind of adding some donks to my lighter paddles. Just like so. And now I'm going back in with the brown and I'm adding just a tad more to it. Now I'm not saying this is going to be the perfect same flame at all. This is my, 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 my same flame. to take some orange 
and some yellow and this and I'm just gonna mix this my fan is blowing down on it first it's blowing on me now on my paints okay I'm just making this really watery down because it's just got a little bit of it in it I'm gonna add some more red. And yes, I just terminated it all. Oh, what I'm thinking. I'm not. I'm asleep. I really am, guys. I guess. This comes out, I'll be lucky. Now I am going in and I'm just making more petals. To cover these. I like these is like behind. Just like so. I'm going to take the hair dryer and I'm going to let that move this while I'm done. And I'll put the fan over again. Now I am going to get the colored pencils. And I'm having to make some stuff to get the table. Okay, 
I got five different coins. I have got prism corn, orange, Spanish orange, dark chocolate of the Crayolas, yellow of the Crayolas, dark mayan, and orange of the prism corns. Now I'm going in with the uh, Spanish orange, and I'm just going in, and I'm just kind of filling the filling this in like I would want it to be filled, and just coloring in. I mean, I'm just doing my dots with these, like if they go in between. Just like so. Now I'm just going in with the yellow colored pencil. And like I said, these is just a mix match. Of course. I mean, you know, all different. Now, I did take my edges off because that's just how I roll. Mm, I don't think. Let me find my yellows. Okay, now we go put stuff along that. Taking the um, primary yellow from uh, prism corn, and I'm just gonna go in and blend this orange in. Now, if you don't have it, you can still probably use Crayolas or whatever you have to do this. I don't know. I just like these prism corners.
Okay, I just sharpened this. And it has a very fine point that don't really matter right now. This is, I like the fine point. Now I need a white. picture of a sunflower handy. I am just swinging this by memory. You have no curl pencils on your this Crayola sponge bit. Now see how sharp I can get it with this that pinch of sharpener, and that is just a fifty cent uh, pinch of sharpen from um, Walmart. If y'all need to know, if y'all want to know, it's the pen and gear. I'll show you about three or four of them the day. This is what they look like the package and it's got the small and the big one and they went great they went better than some of the more expensive ones I've had I mean ideally is my uh, automatic but it's so loud and I'm doing videos 
But I never sharpened pencils before a video. I mean, let's face facts. It's usually I don't even know what I'm doing until I sit down to do a video. Anybody else like to have? And I'm just doing little round circles here. Okay, sorry, I got a notification and I had to check it out, but it's missing. Can't wait. Yeah. It's real paint for our and see what this looks like, okay? okay. I just don't know. Let me heat this tape up. Oh yeah, it comes out so much easier. Okay, that looks pretty good. Even if I say so. Um, oh my God, I got a pen over here. I just signed it with a pencil. I hope y'all enjoyed.
enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe. Share our videos with people. And have a blessed day. Bye.